Hi, I'm Patrick with Cree, and last year we introduced the CR24 LED troffer. With its 90 CRI and its 110 lumens per watt efficacy, it soon became the industry's best-selling LED troffer. Today, I'm excited to talk to you about the CR24 Up Kit, an upgrade kit for existing fluorescent fixtures that uses the exact same light engine as the CR24 troffer. That means it has the exact same performance as the CR24 troffer. And it's so simple and quick to install. To demonstrate, let's do an installation right now. Before the CRLE light engine can be installed in the up kit, you must first install the light engine end caps. These end caps are toolless and snap right on, and are universally tooled to fit both left and right. You'll also need to prep the side reflectors by installing a ground wire, which will later be wired to the light fixture. Before beginning the installation, be sure to turn off the power at the breaker. Then remove the parabolic louver or lens, depending on the fixture, and gain access to the lamps, being careful to remove them and not break them. Our next step will be to remove the belly pan and expose the ballast and wiring. If you have enough clearance in your luminaire, which is about three inches between the bottom of the ballast and the ceiling plane, then there is no reason to remove the ballast. It can be abandoned in the fixture. The same goes for the end brackets where the tombstones are installed. Those can be left in place and should not be in the way of the up kit. If you have concerns abandoning these components, then check with your local inspectors. Now that the host fixture is prepped and ready for the up kit install, our next step is to install an up kit end cap. It inserts between the existing fixture and T-bar and slides to one end of the luminaire. The other end is identical and installs exactly the same way at the other end of the luminaire. With up kit end caps in place, we can now install the side reflectors. The side reflectors are tooled to slide into the end caps and also insert between the existing luminaire and the T-bar ceiling. Both side reflectors are identical and can be installed on either side of the fixture. If the host fixture is secured to the T-bar ceiling with seismic clips or other approved methods, then there is no need to use a separate seismic attachment for the up kit. By inserting the up kit end caps along with the side reflectors between the existing luminaire and T-bar, it has been safely secured in place and cannot be removed unless it is disassembled. If the host fixture is not secured in place, then it must be prior to completing the installation. We'll now ground the up kit to existing ground from the host luminaire. We've completed the mechanical preparation and will now install the light engine. The light engine installs tooless by snapping in and hanging freely so you can wire the luminaire. With all the wiring complete, we simply swing the light engine in place and the installation is finished. Now it's time to turn the breaker back on, energize the CR24 up kit, and begin enjoying the benefits of high quality, energy efficient lighting. Wow, that really was simple. By installing the CR24 up kit, we took an old parabolic and we converted it to a beautiful LED luminaire. And unlike other LED solutions on the market, the CR24 Up Kit is built around the qualities of the CR Troffer. So I'd like to thank you for your time 
and wish you luck with your upgrade.